welcome back to Craft Corner. Today we are making a little Luck of the Irish necklace with some gold and a little shamrock out of Shrinky Dinks. Now I know you're thinking, Shrinky Dinks, oh my gosh, those things still exist because if you are, you know, of the crafty mind, you can probably remember these from like 20 years ago, but they are back with a passion and we are going to make some today. So first thing that you're going to need is the Shrinky Dink paper, which you can get in this sort of like matted color or crystal clear. I like the matted color because then I feel like I can see more of what I'm doing. Grab some beautiful colored pencils. I like this set from Ibu. They've got great colors, really fun. A nice yellow for our gold pieces and a green for our shamrock. And just start coloring on the paper. You can see how bright it looks, it's gorgeous. And then you can cut out a circle on your own or it's super easy to grab one of these hole punchers. And this is a great, it's a one inch uh, circle. It's the perfect size for going in this little vial necklace. So turn it over so that you can see where you're punching. See, I've got all of my circle is covered in that gold. Pop that out. And you're gonna do that like 10 or so times just so that you have enough gold to fill your necklace. After you make those, you are going to make yourself a shamrock. And you wanna kinda make the shamrock the same size as the piece of gold because when it shrinks, it still needs to be able to fit into your necklace. And an easy way to make a shamrock is to color yourself a heart, then flip it and make another heart, and then flip it and make one more heart. Then you're gonna cut that out. And you can go around each little shamrock piece or you can kinda wing it like that. Then, we're gonna pop them in the oven. Set your oven to 350 and watch them shrink. So after your pieces come out of the oven, be careful because they'll be a little hot, I colored my gold with some stickles. This is basically just glitter glue, but it's got a nice little fine tip and it comes out really nicely. Just pop that on there to give it a little extra sparkle. And then you're going to pop it in a little vial. Now these are so cute and simple, makes everything so simple because the chain is already attached to the cork. All you gotta do is pop in your gold pieces, pop on the cork, and if you wanna, if you're giving this to a little one and you wanna secure it with some glue, that's never a bad idea. Pop on the cork and it's ready to go. Your little lucky charm necklace, perfect for St. Patrick's Day. If you like this craft and you want to see some more, please subscribe to our YouTube channel.